Pierre here. Today I'm going to be talking about reptiles. If you enjoy today's episode, so you can like, you know. But let's uh, talk about reptiles. Reptiles are air-breathing vertebrates that include alligators and crocodiles, lizards, snakes, and turtles as well as the extinct relevant forms such as dinosaurs. You know, like the T-Rex and all of this stuff. Reptiles are cold-blooded. I like the warm-blooded. You know, there's some difference between the cold-blooded and warm-blooded. You know, the warm-blooded can sustain the temperature and it but cold-blooded cannot even sustain any temperature. Well, it can, but it cannot sustain the winter. All right. They cannot regulate their own body temperatures and most lay eggs. Number two, prehistoric reptiles. The first reptiles appeared some 30 million years ago. They evolved from amphibians and may have looked similar to some modern uh, day like lizards and you know. About from 230 to 70 million years ago, flying reptiles uh, or pterosaurus appeared and dominated the air f- over a hundred million years. While dinosaurs, such as the mighty Tyrannosaurus rex or T-Rex as for short, ruled the land and reptiles called Ichthyosaurus and Pelosaurus lived in the seas. Reptiles laid eggs with the hard shells like in the bird episode that did not need water unlike amphibian eggs, allowing reptiles to inhabit a greater range of habitats. Early reptiles uh, also produced the ancestors of the remaining two groups of land-based uh, vertebrates. Like, we, so we this one is the reptile. We did the mammal and the bird as well. If you did not check out the other episode, reptile skeletons. Hmm. See guys, there's the reptile skeleton over here. Reptiles are vertebrates, they have. That means they have backbones. Like mammals. Okay. When they are born, they look like s- smaller versions of the adults. Reptile skeletons are very from the specialized forms of lizards, which adapted for life in a variety of habitats including trees, bushes and uh, turtles which unlikely among modern day reptiles have developed an armored shell. Snakes have very strong uh, flexible backbones the longer snakes have as many as 400 vertebrae along their backbone. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Until guys, I see you next time. Subscribe if you're new. Enable all these notifications. And even um, leave a like.
Goodbye.